now I'm nervous. Oh, girl. Oh, God. <laughs> what? Like, okay, no, it's gonna be okay, Sasha. It's gonna be okay. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sasha in case you guys are new here. Thanks for clicking on this video um, I haven't uploaded in about a month or over a month, which is crazy in today's video I want to kind of give you guys a little bit of an update on where I've been or what's been happening or why I haven't been uploading and I just wanted to come back with that type of video and then get back into the swing of things um, I usually do help like tips video or things I think will be helpful or benefit you in the day-to-day -day life and I do plan on getting back to that right after this video so if you're new here um, you know subscribe to the channel and check out my recent videos that I think are helpful and you may find interesting um, I'll have it linked down below and also in the cards and at the end of this video for you guys to click on and go check it out but um, yeah, and if you returned, thank you guys so, so much for returning and for staying subscribed and following me, and I appreciate it. So um, we're gonna go ahead and get right into the video. Okay, so before we talk about the changes that I'm going through in life and kind of like why I haven't been really uploading, um, I wanted to briefly touch on Black Lives Matter. Now this whole, Discussion can definitely have a video by itself and possibly might do that um, But for now I just want to be brief since I hadn't Addressed it really on this channel. I did address it. However on my Instagram channel channel on my Instagram um, Which is simply social 414 if you guys want to see what I wrote you guys can go check it out follow me on there um, but I just want to be brief I obviously believe in black lives matter well, not obviously because, yeah, but um, I am so proud, first off, to be black and the people who are fighting and protesting and sharing and speaking out and just talking out against the injustice of everything. It is hurtful to see that some people just think that there's nothing going on that there is fairness and justice and it's just very hurtful and crazy that you know some people still think that way and I think what really hurts is that people are some people are just yelling all lives matter um, like just being defensive and I feel like and I could be wrong, but I just feel like, you know, the people who are just yelling all lives matter are not really taking a second to listen or understand on why we are saying black lives matter. Why we are, why people are protesting, why we're sharing and sharing and sharing these things that matter to us so deeply. And it just, it just hurts. And it's hard for me to like, put all the words that I want to say and make them make sense and put it out there and um, hopefully that made sense. I just wanted to touch on it a little bit. I'm, I'm really proud again of everyone who is just supporting and standing with all, standing with all of us and tell you guys how I'm feeling now. I just kind of just feel the same, like kind of just drained. I feel like I go in and out of being numb, but um, I have great people that surround me. Um, I have a great church, and I feel the love, and I am and I am appreciative of that. And I just wish we can spread the love further. And I don't know. And just it's just a lot and I just I just hope and pray that we will eventually get to a point where all lives do matter basically so 
the chunk of this video on where have I been? Why have I not posted in a minute? So first off, we're in a pandemic, which I know plenty of you know because plenty of you, maybe all of you, most likely all of you are going through this. The world is going through a pandemic, um, specifically everyone. <laughs> Um, I am a VPK teacher at a preschool, if you did not know. Um, yes, I teach little kids. I teach little four and five cuties. So, a couple months ago, my boss and her daughter told us that they were moving. And yeah, my boss's daughter is was the lead teacher in that classroom. She also is a very good friend of mine. And they told us, like everybody at work, that they were moving like a two months ago, I feel like, or a month ago. And it was pretty shocking, but you know, I'm really excited and happy for them because everybody, you know, has different journeys and everybody has to go through changes to grow. So I was asked to take the lead of the classroom. Um, it was kind of surreal, kind of crazy, uh, um, which is funny. I had the opportunity to be the lead last year and I decided to not do it because I thought I was going to be very busy with a lot of different things and turns out <laughs> Corona had a different agenda. But um, yeah, so it's just crazy how everything works out and now I'm going to be the lead teacher of the VPK class at my job and I'm super excited for the opportunity. Um, super nervous though because my friend she was a really, really good teacher, so it's a little intimidating, but um, I'm up for the challenge, I think, and yeah, <laughs> so I'm super excited for that, but yeah, that has been really a major change that's been happening, and I'm adjusting along with the pandemic thing, so yeah, like I said, it's pretty nerve-wracking with getting closer to school because um, I live in South Florida, so in South Florida, the numbers for the virus is going up like nobody's business. It is getting very, very scary. It is scary. And it's getting to a point where people who you know or you or you may know people who are, you know, catching it. And it's, it's just crazy. Um, and everything is kind of going crazy because, you know, school's about to start and everybody's trying to figure out what to do to go back to school. And it's just a lot going on, and it's just a lot going on mentally, and just, I keep saying it's a lot because it is a lot. But um, yeah, it's just trying to figure all that out. I just wasn't really in the headspace of, you know, filming. I really wanted to. I tried to open my laptop and plan out videos to upload, but it just, it couldn't, it just wasn't, just wasn't flowing. So, um, school starts in about a month. It, like a little bit over a month and um, I was you know getting the classroom together and that is pretty much pretty pretty much almost finished so I think with that being kind of like a okay that's done um, I think I'll be pretty okay with hopefully mentally have some space freed up in my head to like put out more videos and have some more fun again uploading and things like that. So I'm super excited. Um, I wanna go more into the teaching stuff, but I think I will save that for another video because um, yeah, I didn't start teaching yet. And I think it'll be interesting to do an update video about teaching and the whole pandemic thing. Kind of talked on YouTube already. I was gonna say uh, I want to uh, the type of videos I'm looking to upload is very helpful, inspiring videos, motivating, um, positive. Um, I love helping people feel good about themselves and just good in general. Um, but I also want to explore vlogging. Uh, my vlogging skills might be very, very bad in the beginning, but I really just want to upload them no matter how bad they are. Sasha, so you just got to talk to yourself. You just got to talk to yourself to do it. And it'll be fine. I want to do more videos like this, like talking, just thoughts, as kind of like a diary type of thing. So I can kind of create like a time capsule type stamp thing um, and be able to look back on these videos and whatnot. But yeah, it's, it's, it is scary, not gonna lie. It is pretty scary putting your life out there um, for the world to be able to judge and just have opinions on. 
but it's crazy how still a part of me wants to do it so badly. A part of me wants to share. A part of me wants to connect with other people who may think they're the only ones maybe feeling this way or just a few might be feeling this way in some type of way. I don't know. I like to ramble and maybe not, feel like I'm not making sense, but you gotta make sense to someone, right? Somebody out there gotta be make, I gotta be making sense to. So yeah, like I said, we'll see. And I hope you guys stay tuned for that. That's going to be the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this was, I guess, informative. Let me know down below if you guys are kind of going through the same thing, whether you're black, whether you're a teacher, whether you're just a human trying to live your life through this pandemic. Let me know down below. Um, maybe we can have a conversation about it and maybe it'll be an inspiration for my next video of the next topic to talk about. All right. Thank you guys. I love you guys. And I will see you guys next Friday for a new upload video, no matter what. Even if it's me talking again, which I don't want to. I want to switch it up. But, um, yeah, I meant to switch this one up, but I just kept talking. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm going to stop talking now because this is a long video. All right, guys. Thank you guys so, so much. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Mwah. Later. Deuces.